TNN. The Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN Headline News Update. Good morning, everyone. Basil Chapman here on this Tuesday, the 10th of May. This is the 10 a.m. Market updates, TFNN market update. We're looking at the Dow 363 at 32,608. One of the reasons why I expected at least some kind of amelioration of all the selling pressure was because the volatility index, yesterday it seemed it was either, uh, there, there were a bunch of things going on that seemed to me to hold the VIX, the volatility index, higher than you would have expected. And the consistent selling throughout the day looked more to me like um, the, kind of, the kind of action that you see when the market is exhausted from going in one particular direction and then there's this kind of give up. But that doesn't mean to say that this is a major turn. It just says there's a chance that the Dow having hit the, the 32,272 low and then gone under it, closed a little bit below it, says that this is a period that's really important and that there should be at least a bit of a relief rally to the upside. Days young, uh, we're up 323 in the Dow. We're looking at the S&P, SPX, there we go. The S&P trading up uh, 55 points, up 1.39%. The Dow is only up 0.96%. Uh, we're also looking at, uh, at 4,047. It went under the 4,000 level yesterday. Now it's back above. And that's making, I like to look at levels, round numbers, as millennium levels or 100 levels. As really important. So the 4,000 level is a psychological level to be monitoring, just as the 32,000 for the Dow is. The QQQ is a little different because the selling pressure, that extra selling pressure you saw yesterday, said to me that based on the technicals that I look at, the on-balance volume was just overbought enough to have a little bit, maybe the, the, the Qs at this particular point can actually lead the move up. It's up 2.1%. Uh, up six at 303. We'll see the day's young. We're looking at the IWM uh, a little bit uh, better than it was um, earlier. And now it's up 263, 177. We'll look at gold, gold quickly. Gold is just down at the bottom. It's holding uh, a key support level at 1856. Uh, and you're looking at crude oil. Crude oil is uh, down, and the TLT is trying to establish some kind of a piece of tradable low. A bounce. I'll be back with the Tiger Technician Sale and check out my 